Hello everyone, I am Dr. Deepa. Today we are here to learn about the ward layer string. The ward layer string is the ring of the lymphatic tissue which is seen along the interior of the pharynx. The ward layer string which is nothing but the ring of the lymphatic tissue which is seen encircling the cephalic part of the air as well as the foot passage. So here this is the air passage from the nasopharynx, the foot passage from the oropharynx, this ring is encircling obliquely the area of the air and the foot passage. The ring that is the aggregation of the lymphatic tissue which is contributed by this the ring which is seen has got the roof, floor and the lateral wall. The roof this is how the entire ward layer ring is formed where the roof of the ward layer ring is contributed by the aggregation of the lymphatic tissue that is the pharyngeal tonsil which is also called as the nasopharyngeal tonsil so above the ring is limited by the nasopharyngeal tonsil below or the floor is formed by the lingual tonsil which is present along the dorsal surface of the posterior one third of the tongue and the lateral wall of this ward layer ring is contributed by the tubal tonsil and the palatine tonsil palatine tonsil which is present along the lateral wall of the oropharynx and tubal tonsils are seen along the lateral wall of the nasopharynx which is seen adjacent to the tubal elevation. So this is about the ward layer ring and its formation. As we can note down very clearly the roof of the ring is formed by the pharyngeal tonsil, the floor is formed by the lingual and laterally it is completed by the tubal and the palatine tonsil. This is the atlas view where we can just visualize the um, dorsum of the tongue as I have already mentioned the posterior one third of the dorsum of the tongue is occupied by the lingual tonsil which makes up the floor of the ward layer string. The lateral wall of the ward layer string as I have just now told is formed by the palatine tonsil here which makes up the lateral wall of the oropharynx. This is the lateral view that is the medial sagittal view showing the lymphatic masses, the oropharynx, the lateral wall of the oropharynx representing the palatine tonsil in the tonsillar fossa. Above the palate along the lateral wall of the nasopharynx lies the tubal tonsil and the roof of the nasopharynx which is seen here beneath the occiput contains the pharyngeal tonsil which are also called as the nasopharyngeal tonsil. So the roof which is seen here of the this entire makes up the ward layer ring. So the roof by the pharyngeal tonsil as seen here, the floor by the lingual tonsil and the lateral wall by the palatine and the tubal tonsil. So this is about the lymphatic ring. This lymphatic ring is important because it helps in the defensive mechanism of the respiratory and the alimentary system by destroying the entry of microorganisms from the external environment. So it is the important area of the defense mechanism. So this is all about the ward layer ring which is seen in the interior of the pharynx. Thank you.